But one person is taking part in that historic vote, that being Congresswoman Marcy Kaptur. She won re-election, of course, in November, and she is going into her 40th year serving Ohio's 9th District. Kaylee Kirby sat down with the Congresswoman before her swearing in today. Kaylee, what does she hope to accomplish this term? Yeah, Mel and Jeff, she says she already has a handful of things she's working on, and she's excited to see how they progress. And despite the Democrats moving to the minority, she believes her work with the Great Lakes infrastructure and many other industries will still move through Congress. Representative Marcy Kaptur is now the longest serving woman in Congress. Taking office in 1983, she says a lot has changed over the years. When I was first elected, we were in the midst of a terrible uh, recession. And uh, it was it was daunting and I spent my career trying to help our region build itself out of that. She says obstacles came in every decade. But now, years later, a new term means more opportunities to bring money, resources and jobs to the people she serves in our region. She says one of her top goals is to make sure the resources in the infrastructure bill that recently passed actually get delivered. And to create the kind of good jobs and future for our region that's necessary, we have to have very visionary thinking about how we're going to handle our rail lines, uh, the future of transport uh, through our area. Another major focus is the Great Lakes. Her bill to create the Great Lakes Authority passed in December. She says the commission will find and create solutions to the environmental challenges in the eight states bordering the lakes. I so hope that we can work with our power companies and develop a public-private partnership in a way that modernizes our nuclear uh, power. But in so doing, if the federal government helps, create a continuing source of financing for this Great Lakes Authority based on energy across our region. Another thing to mention, recently the president announced an additional billion dollars going to the Great Lakes. Captor says she's fighting to get as much money as she can to go to Lake Erie. Live in studio tonight, Kaylee Kirby, WTOL 11.